before starting the next game, I need a quick update here to update everyone on the off-season moves that the Bruins made going into this game. Players out of the team now are Lucas Benoit, Nelson Ramos, Alvaro Reyes, Hugh Darvish, Jonathan Papelbon, Carlos Ruiz, Ryan Howard, Johnny Gomes, and Jose Bautista. The players in are the legendary Bobby Orr, as well as Riley Smith, David Ortiz, Carlos Gonzalez, Carlos Beltran, Koji Wuhara, Steven Strasburg, Emilio Bonifacio, and Ryan Zimmerman. To start off the third season, the Bruins challenged the Detroit Tigers. I think I already played them, but I guess I forgot that and selected to play them again or something. This is a home game with Bobby Orr getting his first start on the mound. Swings and misses on a good pitch there as he falls behind 0-2 now. And a good pitch there as this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Let's just see if we can get him to chase one more time. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. High, one and two now. A good high fastball. Maybe something. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. And he grooves the fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. And that's going to land out toward the wall out there. Here comes Ortiz around third. Now it's cut off. A throw to the plate. The tag. And he is out at the plate. So much for our first run of the ball game. Swing. Hard hit ball to second. Only play is going to be at first, so that'll go as an RBI that brings home the opening marker of the ball game. That time, and it's knotted up at two and two. Now here it comes. Swing and a miss as he starts the third, the same way he ended the second with a punch out, one away. They get runners in scoring position. And now a slider in there for a called third strike, and there are two gone now. Oh. And with two outs, you want to make sure that... And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Back to the top of the order now, and standing in, the ever-dangerous Mike Trout. Here's a swing, and oh, man! Strikeout pitch working now. That's three in a row for him as there's one away. Runs three hits and no errors in the ball game for the Tigers. Donnie couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane to the plate and that'll be ruled a strike. 0 and 2. And he struck him out. So double digits now. Ten strikeouts for him thus far. Oh, and they've been falling all over themselves trying to get it. But you've just got to know that that's not going to be a strike. It looks like it is, but it isn't. This might be a spot where that high fastball was just a setup so he could come back with that big curve. Uh, and he's just rolling right now, and even dozen strikeouts for him in the ballgame. And you just get the sense that he's got it on cruise control out there now. Make it nine in a row he's set now. They have really been scuffling. 1-1 one, one pitch coming now to Cabrera. And he goes right with the fastball here, a drive out to deep right center field. A leap at the wall, but forget it, it's gone, a home run. Game's being played now, it's one and two. Got him. As he just continues to mow down these hitters, 13 strikeouts now, one and two. And he's going to add to the total, 14 punch outs now as that ends the inning. Well, I think the only thing you have to worry about is that pitch count you see right there. Other than that, he's earned the right to stay out there. Usually the other team will tell you when you're starting to get tired. And that'll put the runner at first here, and we'll have to see how indeed they decide to score that play. Well, I've got to think this is a lack of communication right here. 
I don't know if he heard an I got it or what, but this should be an easy pop out instead. He doesn't even get leather on it. You're right. But I'll tell you, to be down 0-2 against a guy like this with the stuff he's got tonight, not a comfortable spot to be. One and two. And he struck him out. And there's the hat trick as that's his third strikeout of the ball game. For all the pitches he's thrown, only one walk so far. That's a little bit surprising. Gonzalez is there, makes the catch, and the ball game is over. Well, we talked about how they needed a good outing out of this guy, and he gave them that and even more, finishing off the complete game victory. The Bruins were able to come out on top in this one in a very close 2-1 final. Bobby Orr was unquestionably the player of the game as he pitched a complete game, allowing just the one run and striking out 16 batters for the single game record. For the Tigers, one run, five hits, no errors. They left six men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 37 minutes.